Hello there, and as usual, I'm Aaron from Lifestand Gamers, and welcome. So today, I want to share with you a mod that is in a very early stage, but this thing is absolutely awesome. I managed to get my hands on it a little bit early just to show you exactly what it's all about. Now, as you can see here, these are live LCD TV screens getting direct feed from these cameras. So you can see these cameras in various spots around me. And if I move around, you can actually see my character updates. Now, the more monitors you put in at the moment, it causes more lag. But this is absolutely beautiful. Just think of the possibilities, guided missiles, security cameras, and a whole variety of other things as well. And you can use this to check on different areas of ships without having to log into the camera's menu. So as you can see there, there's a little camera screen with me moving back and forth on. Then the next one up, we actually have a hangar bay. So on the zoom in, there's me. We've got the hangar bay. We've got two ships that are parked in there at the moment. We've got hangar bay 2 here that's on display. So I can see what's going on in hangar bay 2. Is someone stealing supplies? Or is there a ship unloading, docking? And there's the front entrance of the hangar bay. So I can also see if there's any ships pulling up and I need to open up the hangar doors. And I can use this on a quick glance. We've also got the reactor room there that's rotating around. And up in this screen, we've actually got the camera that's in this room. You can see the two little cameras in the top. It just looks so awesome. And then near the top left, you can see the camera that's actually viewing that. And it's looking into the camera screens on here. So it doesn't just display black screens. It's actually looking into the cameras that are feeding live back to that camera. So you can see everything on that screen that's on this screen. So you can see the O2, the reactor spinning, as well as my position up there in the corner. And we've got another one of them screens up here. On this one, I'm not displayed. Sometimes it has a little bit of an update thing due to render distance, but he's working on that at the moment and there's loads of little updates and there might be a few little things you see that are a bit off, but they are being worked on. This is a very early design prototype. Anyway, I'm gonna show you this aboard ships and a few other different methods of using this effectively. At the current moment in time, it's running DirectX 9, you can see. He's planning on developing it further into 11, and there's a lot more features, like I said before, that he's got planned for this. So before we move on to having a look at things we can do with the ship, I just wanted to show you with one camera, just to show how fast and fluid it can actually be. So moving on to the camera here, if I move back and forth, and move around you can see the camera is actually displaying that live i can jump and it does all the features it's just it's just so cool this is just an amazing piece of kit something you definitely want aboard your ship so let me just uh, access f8 and move the camera to a different position now from this position you should be able to see the character on the left and the screen moving so let's just hit nine and you can see he's moving there in real time. Very cool. Great for security purposes, especially when you've got people trying to breach the gates. You can reference them security cameras live and take them people out. Very nice indeed. Saves you looking through all their menus. Definitely a great feature. Let's move on. So we're actually inside a small ship now. This is a Henry. I'm using the cockpit modification. You can see I've actually got a weapons cam on the front. You could use a whole variety of different things to build into these systems, but you can see as I move, the camera changes. I've also got the reactor cockpit up here at the top, so you can see we're monitoring the reactor room, making sure no one's breaching there as we're out on a mission. And if I move it into spectator camera and I head over to this other ship that I've got placed here, we can see we've done the same here. We've got some more cameras hooked up to various control panels. That one's a bit washed out with maybe there's a bit too much light in that room, but absolutely beautiful. So I see this has done a great job of this mod. I've probably butchered his name there, but when he develops this a little bit further and he releases this, this is something you definitely want to check out. Anyway, I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I can't wait to see this mod develop further.